Hey guys, it's Jennifer. Today I'm going to show you how to make the most perfect fettuccine alfredo. This is my boyfriend's favorite dinner of all time. He loves it. It is creamy and dreamy and decadent and delicious and it's going to be in your mouth in 25 minutes. So the ingredients you're going to need for this perfect fettuccine alfredo is going to be dry fettuccine, garlic salt, just a pinch, six tablespoons of unsalted butter, three-fourths of a cup of heavy cream, a fourth of a cup of freshly grated Parmesan cheese, and also a fourth of a cup plus two tablespoons of freshly grated Romano cheese. So the first thing I'm starting off with is our fettuccine. So I took eight ounces of the dry fettuccine pasta and I threw it into a pot of boiling salted water. Now you want to make sure that your water is really nicely salted. It should taste like the ocean because that salty water is going to give our pasta really good flavor. And then while our pasta is boiling, we're going to start on this delicious sauce. So I've got my six tablespoons of unsalted butter. I'm going to add my heavy cream to it. And then we're just going to let this melt over about medium heat until it really starts to melt. So now that our heavy cream and our butter are really melting together well, I'm going to lower the heat a little bit and let it keep going until that butter is almost melted. And now we're just going to start whisking the butter and the cream together. Now make sure your heat is on low. And we're going to add a pinch of garlic salt and a dash of black pepper. Now we're going to whisk that together. Perfect. Now we're going to add in our cheeses. And we're going to turn up the heat just a little bit more. And we're going to whisk that cheese into our sauce. And we're going to keep whisking until that cheese is pretty much melted into the sauce. And that's it for the sauce. You are totally done. Now the only thing to do is add the sauce and the noodles together. Now I like my fettuccine alfredo really creamy, so I didn't add all of the noodles, I added about three-fourths of them and then I'm going to see how creamy and delicious it looks. So we're just going to mix it together. Alright, now that is the perfect consistency for me. I like my fettuccine alfredo really creamy, so I'm not adding the full eight ounces to mine. I'm adding about six ounces, but of course you do whatever you want. I am probably in the minority and like mine obscenely creamy, so I'm going to leave it just like this. All right, guys, time to plate her up. Nice piece of garlic mozzarella bread with that. That's another show. Now it's time to taste it. Even though this is my boyfriend's plate, but <laughs> that's okay. Wow. So creamy, delicious, just the right amount of cheese. You don't want too much cheese in your alfredo sauce. This is so good. <laughs> Now this is not a meal that you're going to eat every day, but if you're going to have a nice night, a fancy night, a decadent night, this is what you're going to make. You can find the whole recipe and lots of tips and tricks on engineskitchen.com.